Hello everybody! Welcome back to Let's Play Legends Legend oh. <laughs> Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of the Wind Waker. Oh my god! Tongue tied right off the bat. Oh my god, there's like a rupee up there. Okay, sorry. Yeah, this dude right here. I was actually gonna explain that. He is the choo choo jelly um kinda dude that makes the things. Like he's the doctor, I guess, or the whatever scientist I guess you call him. And he makes the choo choo jellies. Uh, if you take green choo-choo jellies here, he'll make the green uh, potion, which actually resulted in a cutscene I did just off-screen, but eh, it's kind of funny. Kind of like he mixes his all concoction. He's like, oh my god, a new experiment, a new revelation or whatever, and then it explodes in his face, and yeah, anyways. If you really want to see it, you could probably just look it up that particular cutscene. But yeah, I end up going for a green potion instead of a red potion to go to uh, Gandor's kind of towery area. Um, but yeah, that's this dude. Yeah, dr juices, and that's where you bring your choo choo jellies to this guy. And he's on one fall island, by the way. He's in the shop. Um, there we go. Sorry, I broke your stuff. I wanted your run rupee. Ooh! I want that one too. Thank you. I just kind of stocked back up. Anyway, so I'm going to go out here and show you exactly where that is on one fall island. So I didn't um, explain where that was. And also, I apologize in advance because there's a major thunder and lightning storm going on right now where I live. Yeah, this is where he is, right there, right next to the, the door over there. And yeah, not that far from the actual, like, I guess you could call the entrance of the place. But we are stocked up and ready to go, actually. We got a green potion because I wanted to opt out for the red potion because I think I should be able to handle the enemies in there. But I don't know, I might need some more green potion to use my magic armor if need be, if I need help. But yeah, blue potion restores both, and you know, you can get two helpings of that. So yeah, we're pretty well stocked up. Um, another few things I'm going to mention, though, is I looked up about Shark Island. Uh, you guys might have already told me in the comments by the time this goes up, mind you. But I found out that Shark Island, uh, all that's really there is 200 rupees. Um, basically, there is uh, a pole like there that you can jump into, but it's surrounded by flames. And there's a bunch of switches there that you have to hit, I think, in a correct order in order to get them all uh hit in time and that'll like basically drop the flames around the hole you drop down the hole there's a bunch of enemies down there you had to fight probably i think a bunch of dark nuts too and you fight them all and then treasure chest appear and then you get like the silver rupee which is 200 rupees um and then the other place which is the boating course island uh it's just a m mini game to basically test your sailing skills uh it's going to cost you 30 rupees to play and the maximum amount of rupees you can get is 250 rupees uh, but that's kind of more like you get 220 because you have to pay 30 rupees to play the game to begin with. Um, and the last thing is with Beetle Shop Ship, if you get another 30 points on top of the 30 points I already got, I guess if you get the gold membership or whatever it was, um, all he'll do, which is probably why Chuck was so mad in his let's play because I just remember now, is all he'll do is he'll stock up all of your hearts and all of your magic meter. And that's it. That's all he will do. And it's really, it's it's not even worth it. So I don't even think I'm going to bother doing that, to be quite honest. It's just, we're so near the end of the game. I don't want to dilly-daddle around. I don't really need that other extra 200 rupees since we don't really need rupees at this point. We're pretty much stocked up. So I'm just going to warp to the Tower of the Gods. And we're going to get this, this Let's Play, hopefully start wrapping up. Um, getting down there, having some more exciting fun with the story. So yeah, it's, it's pretty epic. This whole cutscene thing, it's pretty darn epic, and yeah, hopefully the thunder and lightning storm will be nice to me, not cut out my power, and yeah, <laughs> isn't too loud over these cutscenes, uh, well, at least with the microphone. I'm sure with the actual in-game sound, obviously with it being a capture card and everything, but alright, so we're gonna just make the wind direction go in the right direction for us, and open the way to the bottoms of the ocean once again. We're probably going to enter a cutscene when we get in there though. Oh my goodness. This is exciting. There's there's actually quite a little bit to do down there, but we are so close considering the fact that we've got all of the upgrades. Look at that. We got everything. Everything, baby. Everything. Oh yeah. Um, there's like the treasure chart stuffs. But here we go. Cutscene time. Well done, Link. You must show the Triforce piece you have assembled to the gods. Alright. There I go. I did it. I finally did it. They're like, okay, yeah, fine. Go down there. Look at the donuts back. The glowing donut. What? Whoa. It's on my hand. 
That's where it should be. Oh, what is this? There in your hand, the Triforce piece now dwells within you. It is the Triforce of Courage, proof that you are indeed the true hero. You have controlled the wind and crossed the seas, and here, near the end of your quest, the power of the gods has been bestowed upon you. Surely, from this moment on, you shall be known as the Hero of Winds. It's not the Hero of Time, the Hero of Winds. Link, Hero of Winds! Go forth! To Hyrule, to Zelda's side! Oh my god! I'm coming for you, lady! I'm coming for you, baby! I'm coming to the dungeon! I'm coming to get you, finally! Whoa! So colorful. And here we are. We're here. And here we go. We're gonna go see her. I might do some bonus episodes with this. Just maybe I might go to this two island. Just do the bonus episodes, like the little mini game. Might give that a try. Might go get the two hundred rupees for bonus. And I might end up going after the other treasure church just for the sake of it for bonus. But we'll see how it goes. It's all broken, and shattered. Uh oh, this isn't good. It's open. It's been it's been destroyed. I don't think that statue was destroyed before. Uh this isn't good. Uh please say you're there, honey. Honey. My girl better be there. Oh, oh wait, she's still there. Ah You must have fought them out fought them off, didn't you, Zelda? Right? Zelda? Say something. I'm happy to see you. Hi! What? No! Zelda! What's going on? Uh oh. You have deceived yourself. Did you think you'd be safe inside the castle? Foolish. Now that my power has been restored, there is no safe haven for you. I have taken your precious Zelda. And here you shall fall into eternal slumber. Oh crap. Thanks a lot, Ganon Dork. Uh oh. Dark nuts. Whoa, this isn't good. They look really epic. Okay, we can do this. Oh jeez. Thanks a lot, dudes. You must be like the elite. The elite of the elites. Oh gosh, stop it. There we go. Come on, come on, hit your buddy friend over there. There we go. I don't even know like what those like kinda like things are without their armor. Like they're just they look so weird. Yeah, you picked up your sword. Well, this is pretty easy. There we go. I'm gonna kill you next. Why can't you guys get hit hurt by the fire? That doesn't make any sense. There we go. Oh, right up against the friggin' thing. Nice. Alright. So, there goes the fire, and... Zelda's somewhere. She's gone. She's been taken, of course. So we can put this back in the pedestal thing. But anyway... So this is probably the last time we're going to be seeing this room, so just take it in, Impa and all the sages. Look at them all. Is that, what's her name? Um, yeah, that's that, the, the Zora chick, what's her name? God, I can't remember what her name is. Oh, God, Rudu, that, I think that's it, Rudu. And, uh, and there's like Lulu from Majora's Mask and stuff. God, I miss the Zoras. Okay. I'm running. That's it. So there we go. And it's basically telling you obviously to go over here. This I can't believe we're already down here. This is awesome though. And do you remember like I think I showed you like cause I was like thought this was so cool. It's like underneath the ocean, like ocean underneath the ocean. Well, and then though I went over here and there's like this thing. Take out your sword. Slash. Yeah. Look at my grin. I'm like, I'm pissed. It's gonna, it's gonna. What's it gonna do? Oh my god. 
Whoa, ew, that's nasty. That's what was there. It just shatters. The barrier that was like little velvety was like got a hard. It sounds, it sounds so velvety got hard and it shattered. That sounds so wrong. Anyways, so we're gonna continue down this way. We got some P hat things over here, which we're gonna shoot with some arrows and take them out with one hit. I don't have time for you P hat things. Ooh, I want the rupee though. I have time for rupee. Come on, die. There we go. So yes, we get to venture further forth in the freaking like underneath here, which is awesome. This is actually Hyrule. This is so sad too because you know Hyrule being down here and everything. Uh, this is so sad. I just want to take a little look around for a second. Oh, geez, the castle and freaking the pathways and things like that. We got more pihats going up here. We got like tons of more enemies. There we go. Get the chewy chewies. Why is chewy chewies down here? Like, and how did they get above the ocean anyway? Like, are they supposed to be from actually Hyrule? Seriously, P Hat, he was actually dodging. You're like the smartest P Hat, like, ever. Oh no! Oh well. I guess you don't really need the chewy chewy things. You don't even, like, they need the magic thing either. God, and he's got these guys guarding the place. Good job, guys. You guys probably get paid the least to do this job. Come on. Oh, bad camera angle. Bad cam. Whoa! You really like, tried to punch me, like, through the wall? There we go. I love the Master Sword. It takes so many few hits to so take these guys out now. Especially these guys. Of all things. There we go. Get the rupees, get the bombs and such. Oh, I'm so odd. I'm so worried if my commentary is a bit like boring right now, but I'm just... This is so awing. Whoa. I think that's Ganon's Tower. Of course you had to have like a friggin' darky nut dude here. Sneak attack! What? What? Why didn't that work? That wasn't fair. There we go. That's better. I was gonna say, I was sneak attacking. It failed. It was horrible. Can I, like, push you off the side? Come on. I do, too. Ha ah, too bad for you. Uh, I think there's something we can grapple onto, or is it... It might be hookshotting. Yeah, it's hookshotting, actually. Again, it's not gonna say, I'm not gonna freaking have, like, you grab a hook and have you hookshot. Free that. At least you get the hookshots to go back. Oh. Of course, he got bats. He has to put bats here. Everything. It's like he freaking went all over the budget for this. There we go. Get on over here. And get inside here. My god. Here we go. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. This is so scary. This is so freaking scary. Oh my god. Look at this place. This, and you're basically gonna have a lot of deja vu in this locate in this um tower because that's what he likes to do. The door. Okay, we're in the lava area. Hmm, Ganon's tower. Oh boy, oh boy. Yep. And this is gonna be a complete deja vu. So I'm wondering which one we want to go for. Essentially what happens here is that you pick a path and it's basically you have to refight or go through a little mini section of the, I guess you call it the temples that you had to go through. Which some of these places don't even seem to be temples. But I guess we might as well go, I think we just went down the lava and just burned. Okay, let's go into this door. I don't even know if we're doing this in order to be quite honest. I'm just going this way and seeing what's here. Okay, I think we are. This is the lava place. And we are going to be... Did I just hear a bird? Or what's his name? Um, okay. So we're gonna be grappling, hooking our way over there. Hold the best. I think you could probably just get on top of these. You just slowly climb up on this thing. And I'm hoping you can... Oh, ha <laughs> ha Oh, thank god I didn't fall. That would have been bad. Jeez, man. Can I... I can't do that, can I? So wait, do I actually have to fall down? Ow! Ow, that hurt. Ow, that hurt. Jeez, I think I'm supposed to, like, swing across and then to the... onto the, um, platform, because there's, like, a platform, like, right down there. I probably have to swing across onto that thing. And then, that way I can get onto the next one. Oh, this is annoying. Come on, because I know this thing's not gonna last. Please grab on, thank you. 
Oh, I swung, I swung too far, too far, man. God, if I die too many times in this location, like, it's not gonna be good. This didn't take up too much heart, heart power, or whatever. Okay, no, I didn't hit that right. No, yes, I did. That's weird. Oh, come on! I totally had that game. I totally had that. Uh, can you imagine me cutting like right until I get over there? I didn't use a grappling hook for so long in sort of a way. Well, not really. I kind of did it at the Forest Haven, so. But I don't know. All right, stupid, stupid things. Stupid tings. God. I, I, oh, jeez. I hate this. I hate this part. You know what? Frigate. It's taking way too long. I'm just gonna cut to when I get over the other side, guys. Okay, guys. We're back. We made it. Oh, my God. It took a few little tries, but it's just because of the, having to get the right angle to freaking get onto this platform. Anyways, we're gonna get on in here, and we're going to be having a little bit of deja vu. Wow, 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 wow. All right. Here we go. It's all black and white for a reason because look at what we got here. Okay, we gotta... Yeah, it's like as if you didn't have anything anymore. I just realized that now. I don't know why I didn't realize this. It's like, they changed your whole entire inventory like from when you like... From when you had pretty much like nothing too. So that's kind of funny. Yeah, I actually landed on the platforms up there. I heard it's actually kind of like somewhat tricky to do, but for some people... God. Yeah, we gotta wait for him to go back up again. Come on, put that thing back up there. That's right. And this is probably gonna be like the rest of this whole episode, just doing this deja vu stuff. Oh, pff. thank you. I almost feel like they're more dangerous this time. Oh, come on. Oh, jeez, he's gonna do that. He's gonna blast fire at me. God, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, jeez, that disintegrated that too. There we go. I should get that. Gosh, I, f I didn't know they like, freaking disintegrate the platforms and stuff. That's weird. There we go. I don't know, maybe like you get a better angle from like doing it from down here than you probably do up from the platforms. I don't know, I'm finding it a bit easier. At least we can use the hearts to stock up. I might just use that just because we're losing a couple hearts and I don't want to waste anything. Come on. Where's that tail? There we go. There we go. And here we go. The last cracking of the shell. Ah ha ha. Onto the platform. Hooray! That's right. We defeated you. Or almost defeated you. There we go. Deja vu again. Leave the freaking dragon's tail alone once again. Okay, let's get down there. Jeez, good thing we didn't like land the lava or something. Can I? Can I please just get get your thing over here? Ah, stop it! Ow! There we go. I was gonna say sorry for the dead commentary. There. I was just trying to focus. I was like trying to get a stupid eye down here. There we go. And that's all it took because we had the Master Sword. So, pff, two hits. And you come back to this room and look at what it's gonna do. And you're pretty much gonna get the pattern here. One deja vu, boss defeated. And that, and then we had to get all of them in order to actually open that door and continue on. I'm just gonna use a couple of these skulls here. Excuse me. To, um... You're talking some stuff, obviously gives you some magic there, and um... Oh come on, I don't want it hurt. There we go. Give me a heart! Okay. Alright, so that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you wish. And I'll see you guys next time in Gatton's Tower. Take care!